Hey guys, welcome back to another Project Explorer video. <laughs> Today, we're going to be looking at alpha. I'm going to ignore the zero. I'm not, it's kind of redundant saying zero. We know it's an alpha, so we're just going to call it 1.3.3. Um, it's not the hotfix anymore, which um, disappoints me deep down inside, but I mean, that's okay. Um, we're going to call it uh, de default world. There's um, basically one large improvement that I want to show off uh, in this quick episode. Um, and that's character customization, which I'm really happy about. I think that's a really cool addition to the game, um, especially for when multiplayer is added in. That's definitely going to be like a needed thing, um, just to differentiate between people. I don't know. I guess like if you play Rust and everyone's just kind of like the same naked, creepy white guy, then um, I, I think it's pretty funny. But <laughs> maybe for this game, it's it's kind of something that you can make your guy kind of more unique in the play field and I'm, I'm moving my mouse around with him as he spins I don't know why maybe I'm getting hypnotized or something I don't know but um, we can choose our hairstyle um, I usually go with the mohawk mohawk here um, and then you know blonde blonde we can we can use red we got like dark brown we got black wanna be emo let's be let's be black hair um, black shirt we can be emo we already have black shoes um, is that black? That's black pants right there. Okay, and then our skin. Would it, would it be racist if I said he's emo and I made him black skin? Is that racist? I don't know if that's racist. Um, maybe we'll just try to not be racist and only choose a white person. Well, that's also racist. I don't know. You you decide. Tell me if that's racist or not. Um, and if it is, I uh, I should probably you know go join the Ku Klux Klan or something because. I didn't realize how racist I was. Um, let's let's start this, and it moved again. This is weird. Whenever um, the, I start a game on Project Explorer, it the the window moves, and so I have to like readjust it for for my uh, recording kind of space. So here we're gonna run around with our emo guy. Um, we're gonna run around this lake, around this emo lake. We're gonna call this emo lake because we spawn right next to it. We emerged out of the water. Um, an emo kid. We press one and uh, get our stones out. Start chopping wood. So yeah, that's um basically the biggest change I wanted to show. Um, in in 1.3.2, um, they fixed a bunch of the sounds. They made the sounds nicer. The rain is, apparently has been changed. Um, it looks different now or something, um, which is cool. Maybe we can wait till it rains or something like that. Um, we can build an axe and break into that house over there and see see what we get. Let's just do a quick little, quick little run through of this, this cool game. Let's cut down this tree. <coughs> All right, I cut down four trees, so that should be pretty good. Um, so let's go back over this house. Uh, around, we're gonna go around the emo lake, through the desert of of sand, and into Grandma's house, which we are going to build a um, request tab and we're gonna build a uh, axe and we're gonna break into her house and we're gonna murder her face and take our, um, off all of her uh... oh no wait we need to kill we need to go kill um... We go kill some endangered bears and wolves and stuff that's good really quick um, before we actually break in because we need to tear off their skin and use it as cloth so we can um, tie uh, uh, the stones onto the sticks um, to make our axe so let's go find a an endangered animal somewhere. Um, we, I think, if the dev, I noticed that. Um, oh yeah, here's the rain. The rain, yeah, the, that's really nice. It reminds me of the the Minecraft rain kind of. That is definitely a lot nicer. Good job on that. Um, also the noise, the noise on it, it's a lot softer. I don't know my my recorder has been having a hard time picking up um, game noises recently, so. Sorry if you can't really hear that. I could probably try to turn it up. Yeah, there you go. You might be able to hear that out better. Also, this might be a lot louder if I hit stuff. But um, if we don't find any endangered animals, we can I can just sit through breaking into the house, um, and and then we can just beat Grandma to death with this rock instead. I think that'd be good. Um, I f forgot what I was gonna say to the dev, but I I noticed that you've been watching these videos, and I just want to thank you for your kind uh, comments and stuff. Um, it's a great game. I really enjoy it, and I really see a nice uh, future for the game. Um, so yeah, 
We're gonna break into this house and I'll be right back. All right, we're in Grandma's house and it looks like she escaped actually um, before we could uh, beat her to death, but that's okay. We're gonna steal her book and her ceiling and um, also her teddy bear. We're gonna put that in our um, inside of our face here. Um, we got a crowbar from from Grandma from when she you you know um, used to be a a a big you know she used to be big on um oh that that's a new texture too I didn't I didn't notice that that's a nice texture I like that um, the small crate texture I'm guessing maybe if I press tab and I go to the crates then yeah they both have new textures that's pretty nice I really like those textures maybe the backpack is still off <laughs> it oh it's obviously not changed yet but um, and he's going through all the the textures. Let's see if any other textures are changed. I really do enjoy those. Uh, maybe the campfire has changed. I can't really remember. Um, maybe the gun. Maybe the gun was changed. The gun was changed. I do remember that. Um, and the bullet doesn't really need to be changed. Any of that stuff. Let's grab this crate. Um, so yeah, I like the textures. Oh, here's a wolf. Ooh, come here. I'm gonna endanger you even more. Um, ah, come here, you wolf. No, don't run faster than me. Alrighty, well, um, this is a quick look at um, Alpha 1.3.3, um, Project Explorer. If you enjoyed the video, uh, please leave a like. And if you want to get the game, it is on Steam. I think it's around, like, maybe maybe $5, $6, something like that. Um, it's a great game. I would I would get it now. It's cool, because it might might get more expensive when when it gets better and there's more stuff implemented into it. Um, cause I think it's going to be a great game when people are all playing it online and stuff. So, um, it's on Steam, Project Explorer, really cheap. Um, get it, it's nice. And I'll see you all in the next video. Take care guys, bye!